Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel Mathematics. Let us discuss this interesting geometry problem. We have to find the area of this shaded triangle. There is a rectangle whose sides are given to us and there is a square given to us in this figure. So now to solve this question, first I will use the properties of the rectangle. We know that in the rectangle all the angles are nothing but 90 degree and the opposite sides are also equal so this is 6 this must be 6 this is 12 so this side must be 12. Now I can see that the one side of the square is nothing but the diagonal of the rectangle. So first I will find this side by using Pythagoras theorem in this triangle. So let me assume this side to be x. So I can apply Pythagoras theorem x square that is hypotenuse square is equal to 12 square plus 6 square. So this will become x square is equal to 180. And if you will take square root of 180 that will come out to be 6 root 5. So in this way we can find the diagonal of the rectangle that is nothing but the side of the square. So this is 6 root 5. So the sides of square we can mark by 6 root 5. So now we have to find this area of triangle. So now in this triangle I can see that I know the base length that is 6 root 5. If somehow I am able to find this height a which I have defined by A, I can easily find its area, half base multiplied by height. Now to find the value of A, I will draw one more perpendicular from this point on the opposite side which is nothing but the diagonal of the rectangle and that is also the side of the square. Because I can see that sum of these two lengths is nothing but side of square that is 6 root 5. So first I will find the value of B and then I can find the value of A easily. So to find the value of B, I will apply the area of triangle. I can write this area of triangle in two ways. One of the ways is half 6 multiplied by 12, that is base multiplied by height. Another way is if I will take the base as 6 root 5 and height as B. So I can write the area half 6 root 5 multiplied by B. Now we can see that half will get cancelled out, 6 will get cancelled out b will become 12 by root 5. So that is the value of b. Now you know that a plus b is equal to 6 root 5. So we can easily find a which is nothing but 6 root 5 minus b. That is 6 root 5 minus 12 by root 5. Simplifying it by taking LCM this will become 30 minus 12 by root 5 that is 18 by root 5. So now we know the value of a. We can easily find this area which is nothing but half base that is 6 root 5 multiplied by height that is equal to a that is 18 by root 5 and we can see that root 5 will get cancelled out 2 3s are 6 so the area will come out to be 18 multiplied by 3 that is equal to 54. Hey guys if you find my videos interesting don't forget to like the video because that will give me motivation to make more videos like this. And if there are any other methods that you can think of solving this geometric problem, please feel free to share in the comments below. Thank you so much for watching this video and I will see you in the next video.